A study by the CGL Union Bruno Trentin Association has found that less than one out of two Italians of working age had an occupation in Italy in 2013. Employment rate in Italy stood at almost 49% last year, the study has revealed, with Greece being the only European country with a worse employment record. The research has also found that although unemployment rate in Italy was in line with the Eurozone average at around 12%, employment rate is 8 percentage points below, compared to the situation in the 18-member Europe. These statistics are indeed worrying. People don't even look for a job anymore. Labor reforms and fresh investments are urgently needed. Only the agriculture sector in Italy is showing some signs of recovery. The number of working-age Italians classified as inactive hit a record 20 million in 2013, the highest number since the National Bureau of Statistics, ISTAD, began tracking the figure in 2004. Furthermore, the percentage of Italians who were inactive because they felt that no regular work was available was also on the rise last year. It is true, there is a very high number of inactive people in Italy. The world of labor has completely changed. Permanent jobs don't exist any longer, and most decent jobs today are filled by older people who hold age-old views on how the system works. But the dynamics in the system have changed, and unfortunately, Italy is struggling to acknowledge it. Coldiretti Farmers Association has recently recorded a 12% increase in secondary agricultural education enrollments. Can agriculture be the solution to unemployment in Italy? Max Civili, Press TV, Rome.